was sort of a disaster for us. Um, you know, practice felt okay. Uh, we made some strange changes, but it, it wasn't enough to push us further than the top 32. So we got knocked out pretty early, and that kind of, you know, that kind of brought me down a little bit. I was pretty depressed. I was pretty beat. And um, when that happens, you start to doubt yourself. You start doubting your skills. But you know, my team still believed in me, and that's kind of when we realized, okay, we're we're gonna really change things around. We got to make some big, drastic changes. So it was all that that rage anger um, just thinking about how disastrous Long Beach was all those elements put together was kind of kind of what brought us the, the huge success in Rhode Atlanta which is round two um, we qualified decent and uh, I think it was sixth place and we managed to climb up to second place on a podium so that was a huge sigh of relief for us knowing that we had an extremely competitive car. You know, after we finished Seattle, we only have two more rounds left in Texas and Irwindale. And we just want to finish strong. We're going for the championship. I mean, this is the closest that myself and the Grady team has gone to the championship, so we don't really want to let it go to waste. But yeah, this year's been great. You know, Sound Racing has been doing a phenomenal job supporting Frederick Gospo and I, who are in the top five in points. So it's, yeah, it's an interesting year. It's the year of the Scion. And Gritty Performance has always you know, been one of those companies that I've looked up to. You know, growing up, being a car kid, when you hear the name Gritty, you automatically know JDM, high performance company. You know, they make all these high quality performance products. So when I first joined Sign Racing, I was driving for another team. And that was also a really known team, RSR. They make quality exhaust, mufflers, suspension, springs, and whatnot. They were an awesome team, too. But um, Scion's deal is you know they, they switch it up a few years so when I had the offer when I when I first heard the news that Gritty Performance was looking into you know picking up the team I was more than excited I mean I always looked up to Gritty Performance and trust so yeah when um, when the news came immediately my answer was yes yes please let's do this we did all the development from ground up, not really knowing what the car was capable of. So we struggled, and we struggled big time. You know, it brought us down as a team. We went through some hard times, and that's what makes this successful year that much better. 